morning, afternoon, or evening, depending where you are right now in the world. Welcome back to Templar's Paint Lock Picking. Almost forgot my channel name. Anyway, I want to show you a challenge lock that I'm going to be putting into the package. And in a minute, you'll see the rest of what my giveaway is going to be once I hit my 700. Let me give you a little closer look. This is going to be a great challenge lock for somebody. These are the pins I made. Um, these are top ones are all steel. Um, it's still got some shavings on that uh, number one, I think. Um, anyway, we'll go by the bottom pins there. Um, bottom key pins, the number one. It's just a massive serrated pin. Um, the second one is like an hourglass shape uh, with a serration in the bottom. It's not bent. It just looks like it is. It's straight. All of these are straight. Um, number three is this is a totally serrated pin. I went nuts on that. Um, besides the big ones, you look real closely, there's micro serrations in it. Um, three is just like a Christmas tree. Um, the fourth one is a serrated all the way up there to the last, which is a spoolish slash another serration. Another type of, um, it's like a uh, hourglass top, serrated, and a nice space in between. And then we get the top pins, totally serrated pin on the top there, number one, two. Uh, you can see the spaces in between. The, they're all all different. Um, it's hard to see the depth in them, but they've got some deep grooves. Uh, another totally serrated pin, a uh, another serrated pin of a different kind, and this is almost like a corkscrew. Um, I figured out a way how to turn a pin, um, almost like a screw, uh, and then I put a little like a tit towards the bottom, uh, um, which is kind of interesting. I, I'm going to start making some new pins now um, with the way I found how to make a screw type of pin. Uh, and the last one again is a serrated pin that's just massively serrated. Springs I'm leaving all the same. The core has been, all of them are threaded. One, three, um, and six are undercut. That's the bidding on the key. And someone's going to win this lock. Stay tuned, I'll show you what, uh, I gotta clear this off and put my giveaway stuff on there. One minute. Okay, and here's what's gonna be for my 700 subscriber giveaway. When I hit that 700, I'm gonna hold a giveaway. And this is what I'm gonna be giving away. I'm giving away a brand new, um, pack lock that they just came out with. Um, super Super great lock. I still haven't picked it yet. Um, security pins in it, all steel pins in it. Um, and you could buy a package. Oh, I have, I bought quite a few of them, uh, core replacements that you can rekey it, just like you've seen the videos on it. Um, goes in any of the pack locks. The next one is a master lock. It actually is a combination lock. And it has a key on the side, so you can practice your picking uh, ability on your combinations, decoding it. And you can also practice your uh, picking on it with the key. I'm going to give away one of these little heads here. I put mine uh, on my vise. Kind of like it. It's made for a stick sharp. Has all the uh, fittings and uh, whatnot. If you're going to put it in your car... Uh, you most certainly can. It's got all the fittings to adjust to whatever stick you got. I'm going to give a brand new mortise cylinder away. Um, I did want to show you this. Um, this is the one I just got done pinning up. It works beautiful. And boy, it is tough. Um, this is going to be Thumper's uh, Illusion. Uh, so this is going to be a challenge lock I'm giving away with it. Um, you also got a master pack lock, uh, safety lock, I guess you would call it. And there's not so good dimple uh, core. Uh, 
and it's for beginners, you'll, eh, you should be able to open it. Uh, you know, if you drop it in the right way, it'll open. Uh, but it is, it's a, it's a stout lock. Uh, I was going to somehow disassemble it, uh, pull the pins out, uh, grind them down and stuff and put a new core in there, but I'll let someone else do that. I'm not going through all that bother. So I will probably add to this. Um, I had a bunch of other stuff. I don't know what I want to put in it. Um, the, uh, the giveaway is going to be, I want to say it's just for the United States, but I got too many good friends that are elsewhere. It's just, uh, if, if someone wins this from uh, out of state, you know, over this, uh, uh, over the pond, under the pond, whatever you want to call it, uh, different countries, it might take me a minute to get to you. I just don't have eighty something dollars in shipping um, funds available to me for a while. Uh, I know it's going to be a little bit before I hit the seven hundred, but still, um, I'm trying to live off what I got going here, so. I do have a bunch of pack locks I want to sell, uh, all different models, all different trailer hitch ones, all that. I got the cores that I'll get rid of, and I got two left of the Federal 500s, um, and I, I swapped the cores in it for a Medico and, a, and, a, and another one, which is uh, virtually impossible right now for me to pick. So that's going to be the giveaway. I hope you like it. Um, Whatever you can do, get me more subscribers. You know what? I'll, I, I'll throw in something extra to the person that brings me the most subscribers besides this giveaway. And I'll see what I can do for you. How's that sound? All right, guys. Thank you for joining me on another video adventure of Thumper's Lockpicking. Please hit that like and subscribe button. Tell a friend. Get me some subscribers so we can get this giveaway underway and if you're one of the people that uh bring me a lot of subscribers or whatever uh i'll be sending you something uh just for that okay don't put your picks on anyone else's locks unless you have explicit permission and thank you for joining me i am gone